And with four days to go before the Guardians home opener, we got some news today of some changes this year at Progressive. Those changes affect everything from food to flowers. Photojournalist Carl Bachtel has that story. Construction abounds at Progressive Field. Many new renovations are complete, like the new Paul Davis Pennant District. It's specifically for group events. No more hosting groups outside the ballpark on Carnegie Avenue. We can do that inside Progressive Field finally. On the left field side, the open air terrace garden, complete with colorful pansies from Petites. You know, pansies are very tough, short lived but tolerant of Cleveland cold. Did I mention the construction? As we won't be fully completed with the renovations until opening day of next year. They've also been working on the food, a diverse selection of new ballpark fare from spicy pulled pork to chicken and JoJo's to chula bowls. You have a choice of uh, chicken tikka, uh, sauce, yellow lentils with a choice of two proteins. So you get paneer or you get chicken as well and served on rice. You won't need to clean out your wallet either. Progressive Field has gone cashless and paperless. The ticket office will no longer be an option for fans to purchase tickets as we're fully digital at this point. Hopefully the new food and amenities will help the Guardians eclipse last year's attendance numbers. In Cleveland, Carl Bachtel, 3 News.